There's no way King Dorfin had to say. Because they were suffering in Zora's domain. It is all because of that beast Runa. Injured was a frog and I repairing the domain. Of our materials are a bit depleted. Yeah. Luminous stones. Here's the stones. And a two, and a three, and a four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten! Thank you! Double thank you! But the rooter is stopped as well. Sorry, Lenny. Need something? It's the princess. She's also King Dorfin's daughter and Sidon's older sister. It was a Zora champion and can heal wounds with ease. We all loved her dealer, dearly. A hundred years ago, she piloted the divine beast of Aruta to help fight Calamity again. But next, well, I'm sure you can figure it out. Who are you? Years ago, I asked you to choose between me and Mifa. I'm sorry about that. You're the Caden, I'm a mother of one. My daughter's name is Finley. We're all very happy. Well, that's a hard F. That means I got cock blocked twice! That's no fun. Curse you! You blocked me twice! Curse you, Sakurai! Curse you, I say! Whoop, oh, sorry. It's a Marit Mart. On the general store, the Coral Reef. Our workshop, the Hammerhead, is also here. Marit Mart. The general store and the workshop, they're the best shops ever! And together they're called Marit Mart! The general store. It's over a hundred years, and it has a long and honorable history. Shopkeeper Clef is really serious, but his younger sister Tona is head over fence for Prince Sidon. The workshop. His name is Dento. He's my grandpa. He's the one who fixed Mifo's weapon, the light scale trident. That's it. Go say hi to all of the people. Let's see. We have swift violets, which can I get a picture of those? Gotcha. They'll help you run fast if you cook and eat them. There are arrows for travelers. If you see something you like, just grab it, they'll grab it on the table. Ah. Show other business with me. I'd like to sell! Oh. Let it open out. You are a Goron! What? Uh, sir? Ooh. Highly, aren't you? It's rare to see your kind around here. I was roaming, around, roaming nearby my travels when Prince Sidon recruited me and brought me here. Seems I can touch shock arrows, but I also a well a lot. I don't really carry you on my back. That's what Prince Sidon said to me. And a rude of him, wasn't it? Just 
the Lady Mifa really thinks he can just come wandering in here like nothing happened. What business do you have here after all these years? The weapons workshop. Well, what are you doing? Trident maintenance. Trident. Skill trident. And the ceremonial trident. Because you walked in here. I mean, no, so it's the light skill trident. So, this whole Mipha's Grace thing, I'd very much like to know what the cooldown on it is. Because it's probably on a cooldown. Dryden? <laughs> That is not your business. And I'm just like, but, but I want the trident. I knew I was supposed to come back up here. We have cutscene and speaking to do. <laughs> well, there's no longer any danger of a great flood laying waste to Hyrule. You appease the divine beast of Aruta and thusly saved Zora's domain. <laughs> I must sincerely apologize for my harsh treatment to you. The whole time you were thinking of my rule and leading me well being just like the rest of us. Members of our council humbly fold our fins back in gratitude along with the rest of our people. Perhaps the older generation of Zora, myself included, misunderstood Hylians after all. It would seem so. That said, I would be overjoyed if you could find it in your heart to forgive me. If not now, then perhaps one day. I implore you to collect the treasure inside that chest over there. It was cherished by Mipha, by Mipha, a memento of sorts. I'd like you to have it as a token of our friendship. Please take good care of it. It's here without your trusty blade. The sword that seals the da... Giant fishman who jiggles when he laughs. You know of thing that stone immediately wants upon hearing. How obtain? Is it truly lost? Legendary blade that only you, the Hylian champion, can wield. It is no doubt resting somewhere within Hyrule, even now, waiting for its master to return. All of the Zora thank you from the depths of our hearts for your heroic and selfless work. And you too, Sidon. So, your father, I am proud of you for fighting the Divine Beast alongside Link. You've grown much recently. I know you'll be a worthy heir when your time comes. <laughs> He's jiggling again. <laughs> yeah! You were like twice my height. Oh! A top tier expression of gratitude. <laughs> Complete. What's in here? A spear of peerless grace cherished by the Zora champion Mipa. Although Mipha specialized in healing abilities, her spearmanship was in a class all its own. Uh, you're not just going to present that to me and tell me my inventory is full, are you? Now, that reminds me, if I were to go present this to that guy... I also don't know if this breaks. Well, it's still a bit of an assignment, of course. But you're not half bad. I wouldn't mind talking with you for a bit. Remember the song from the Champion Festival? 
Sure. Get from the sky. A scale of light splits the feet of a veiled false sight. Your trial awaits its glowing bright. I don't care what the song is about, but I'm singing it at the next Champions Festival. Mr. Trello is supposed to get the festival together, but he hasn't done anything for it yet. The ceremonial song. Hello, Sidon. I need to go to the workshop and go talk to the guy. Guy! Random Grandpa! I have heard. Hylian Champion Link. Now Lady Mifa can... No, now, Lady Mi now Lady Mifa's spirit can finally rest in peace. The champion, you should be able to use both the light scale trident and the ceremonial trident. If you break either one, please let me know so I can remake it for... gigantic elephant thing that I went inside of and the fight against the bad that was in it. You missed all of that. Don't worry, it's on archive. If you go into the videos section later, you can actually go through the entire trek here as well as inside the thing and all of that. That reminds me. Please tell me that if I go to load... Well, I don't get to enjoy the boss battle. Note to self, save before the boss battles. I'll have to go back later and get back here. I will do that later. Not right now. Because right now, I have places to go and things to do. Namely, I need to find out if this place has a clothing shop. It does not appear to have a clothing shop. This makes me very sad. Whoosh. Off to the next one. There's more story to there's more story progression that must be done. Oh! That reminds me of uploading literally the entire playthrough of this to the to the YouTube channel from down below. So ye. Yeah. In case you want to see the whole thing. All of the failures and everything. Namely, of me finding something something much higher level than me and then getting hit once and dying and being somewhat spooked of it. There's a shrine. If I can find it. Oh, hello. Let me just glide down to you and, you know, and do that. Oop. Doing these will get me more will get me more of those spirit orbs which will let me upgrade myself more. Alright, what's this one? What am I doing? Am I fighting? I'm fighting. I don't have a shield. I should probably fix that. All right, what am I fighting? Oh, just this little thing. Oh, it's got it's got a it's got a shield and sword. Ow! 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 Windmill of Death!
The windmill of death technique is by far my favorite. Just literally just start spinning like a madman and just bashing everything to death. Thank you for the free bow. Boop. Nice. Thank you for your power, old monk dude person. I appreciate your power. I will use it to probably upgrade my stamina. Because I need more of that. I'm pretty much alternating between health and stamina as as I see fit. That's pretty much what how things is how how it's been happening. Just alternating between the two. Excuse me. Let's go over to that one next. I'm also trying to figure out what the cooldown on Mitha's Grace is, if it even has a cooldown. For all I know, it's for all I know, it's for story purposes for during the final fight. But I imagine that's not quite the case. I imagine that it's it's a cooldown oriented thing. Because a lot of what I've seen has been about making me strong, making me feel stronger. So I have no idea, but we will find out. Why is that keys on fire? Why are you on fire, sir? Why are you on fire? No. No reformation for you. I would like another one of those. However, I'd also like to have this because, you know, it's a fast weapon. I need to go up that mountain. Don't mind me just gliding down. What's a fire choo choo? That's a bigger fire choo choo. Girl, I'll do me some fighting.
Things are dumb as hell. Oh, the jelly itself also blows up. Good to know. Please don't. Sir! Windmill of death! I should run. I should run and at least heal. Is he still in heard back from Roxio? You mean Corel, not Roxio. Roxio no longer exists. Ow, my face! Boy! I'm about to make you learn about pain! By bashing your face in! then I would say contact them again and do so every few days until they answer. It's 4 a.m. Fair, fair. What the? No. In the end, y'all blow up into loot, so. Also, I am flashing red. That's bad. We'll take money. Thank you. I will almost always take money. Note to self. Cook up more food. There we go. No longer flashing. Okay, well that way appears to be to the Gorons, so what if I were to go over in that direction? Then again, I should probably go to the Gorons because they're literally like right there. Or is that not the Gorons? That might not that that might not even be the Gorons. This is a big map, okay? A very big map. Oh, 
but that's an F on having not heard back from Corel. That's a large F. It's a shrine. My me, my little blipper tells me it's going this. Tell me to go. Tells me to go this way. I mean, you have every right to be pissed. So. Yay, look at him. What the hell? Passing the flame. Oh, I get it. I need a torch for this. I understand. It's blocking. It's it's it's. I'm, I'm supposed to move this for some reason. Well, that was blocking that tunnel there. But what are these blocking? Probably nothing. Hello, friend. I would like your power, please. That puts me up to eight. heart container and some extra stamina. I could literally warp to Kakariko and do both of those things right now. I probably should.
fact that it grows straight out of the cliff face is just weird. Truth or dare, son. Truth. Hit me with the truth. Ah! The birds are evil! Also, I'm gonna be playing Breath of the Wild for a while, Tuna. So. I'm pretty much going to be playing that till I go to sleep. What is your aspect on life and death? What is your aspect on life and death as a whole? What do you mean my aspect on it? Do you mean like what's my point? What what's my point of view? Is that what you mean? My point, aspect, point of view, same thing. Um, primarily just the fact that things are put in this world to do something or to serve something. And that's pretty much just it. Once that's over, they die. There's not really any other way of, any other way to put it. Where do I see myself? Nowhere, honestly. No mere mortal is high enough on that chain to matter. I'm just here to entertain people and have a good time doing it. Until I find my pur until I find a greater purpose than that, that's my plan. Mortal Kombat, so just pawns in a video game for other world for other worldly game creators. That would be a sick and twisted joke. Us playing games inside of a game would be a very sick, twisted joke. What I would appreciate, though, I could appreciate that. Because it's ironic. Very. Very ironic. Don't mind me while I just casually ascend this mountain. We are once again back at getting over it with Stoneheart. There's just a character made by someone, and when we sleep, the character creator is sleeping. <laughs> again, it would be very ironic. but it's the kind of irony that I can appreciate. Ooh, there's a shrine somewhere close by. I need to find that. I don't need to scale up that. There's a tower over there, but I've already activated that tower, I think. Wait, no, I haven't. It's not pointing up. When you die in your dreams, your creator is thinking about to kill you, knowing you're getting too strong and powerful. Okay, now we're starting to talk about, like, frickin' Undertale nonsense. Well, not Undertale, but you understand what I mean. Now, now we're just getting on into what's Undertale. Do you, do you really not know what Undertale is? I already, I can imagine you do, because everyone on the internet knows what Undertale is. I don't know what you're talking about. I never care never cared about it. Um go look it up then. Go experience it for yourself. Go experience being punched in the feels like everyone else. Go experience being repeatedly punched in the feels.
Also, Russ, if you haven't played Undertale yet, I swear that I will legitimately pay for just a full-on Undertale stream. Okay. Good. But I mean, I'm down to play it again. No, I would only pay if it's your first time. Because that means you're getting punched in the feels properly. Like everyone else. Everybody, everybody deserves to get punched in the feels. Uh, I don't have feels, my creator said, and made, and made me saying no feelings is a flaw. And I was not designed to have flaws, that's why I'm perfect. No one is perfect, Tuna, don't, don't kid yourself. That's straight up magma down there. That is straight up death magma. That is straight up touch it and you die magma. I still haven't died yet, still alive, so. No, that just means the universe hasn't figured out how it wants to kill you yet. Ow. I see a shrine. And I see a tower. I'd like to climb the tower. Then go to the shrine. Now I can just warp back to the tower. Mm. But the universe won't kill me, or I will, will it before it gets to me? I don't get it. I'm playing through near. I want to exp- I- I'm hesitant to watch more near because I actually want to play the game myself. Because it's a game that I've been interested in. Lank, why are you so terrible at climbing? You get you get winded by like the the simplest things. Why? There we are. Put it in the hole. Yo, hold up! Square Enix made near. Okay, now I really want to get it. If it goes on sale, I'm getting it. If it goes on a big enough sale, I'm buying it straight up and playing it. Your head is being devoured by the demons. I'm aware. Alright, Rock. Gimme some a dead dream. All right, now I'll go to the shrine. What's that? Is that magma? I... Ow! Ow, my face! Ow, my face! Ow, my face! This is not a place I was meant to be! Alright, I'd like to go to see them over there. Too many you concern me greatly. Why is that? <laughs> a multitude of reasons. He's concerned me for a long time, Russ. He's Tuna. Oh, Lord.
<laughs> Fair point. The Omen Owl Shrine. Way back up at the plateau. I should not be using metal stuff. I realize this now. Game, stop it. Oh no. Oh no. I'm gonna get zapped. I'm gonna get zapped! Please come into my stream for the viewer count. Fine. Also, you realize that I've been at work the other times that you've been streaming, Russ. You realize that, right? I've been at work. I can't just drive home to tell my PC to, you know... Give me a second. Let me see if that you're. Are you live right now? Or... No, you're hosting someone. That's an app. If I'm home, then ask me. I do delivery work still, remember? No. I could have sworn I told you. Okay, seriously, what's causing this lightning to want to zap me? Stop. Why does it want to zap me? Time for the raid, BRB. Oh, no. Seriously though, why does the why does the sky want to kill me? Wait, this oh, it still wants to kill me. Sky, please stop trying to kill me. I I would rather not be zapped by the sky. I'm trying to figure out exactly what causes you to get zapped. Maybe I need to unequip my shield. Because I think my shield has a metal part on it that's causing the, the zappy zaps. Maybe that's what's causing it to potentially zap me. Probably the metal armor you have. I mean, I suppose this does have a little bit of metal to it. Let me equip that instead. And let me remove the shield. Alright, let's see if it wants to zap me now. Do you still wish to zap me, world? Yes, you do. Why? Still? Why? Why must you continuously try to zap me? Wait, it stopped. It stopped trying to zap me. God damn it. I want to climb up this. God damn it. God damn it. It was the bow. It might have been the bow, yeah. I'm just, I just want to climb you. Please. Please let me climb you. That sounded wrong. And once again, Stone is trying to climb a mountain in the rain. Hey, you can say GG now. 
I climbed it. I climbed it, 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 it up it. I climbed the mountain. Hello there, everybody. <laughs> As it flies through the air. Smack. I'll take that seared steak. Right, the rain is stop the thunderstorm is stopping. It's cold as hell here. Wait, that's not the... There's the duble. The warm duble. Ah! As the game considers zapping me again for my insolence. I worked 30 hours overtime and got almost almost $1,500 just in overtime. Nice! Good job! Give me, that, give me that extra stuff. Wait a second. I remember how to get across this. I simply lift this. And then I put this over here, like so. And then I drop it. And it kind of sort of forms a thing I can climb. There we go. Want to see the pretty monster I'm fighting? Sure. I mean, I won't be able to look on stream, but you can send me a, a Discord picture. And I can look at that. That's the that's so that's the Gerudo. I'm drop bomb. <laughs> Silly flying monster, you cannot handle the power of bomb. Remember when I said I was going to go upgrade and then completely neglected to do that? I should probably consider doing that. Whee! Here, Stone, let's do, let's do this. Your bomb versus my ancient white dragon. I mean, I've baited around everything but that Lionel that I found with bombs and killed it. So I bet I could probably bait around a dragon. Also, your dragon doesn't exist in this universe. That is not how this works. There's such things called mods. But why would I install a mod so that you could throw a dragon at the guy who is like, what, five hours into the game? Why would I install that? Make it funnier? No. Or make it funner? Also no. Oh! It's got- it's got a butt rock. Ah! It, it threw its arm at me. It threw its other arm at me. It's gonna try to sit on me, isn't it? Yep. Thanks, Mifa! Oh, and then I have a little gear! J little gauge that tells me 
Don't mind me, I'm on your back. Eventually, you're gonna plant yourself. And when you do... Sir? Oh, it realized I was on its back. Ow. Also, thank you, Mifa. Thank you, best fish, for, you know, being best fish. That is not how I boop it on the back. That's how I boop it on the back. F. It's gonna try to punt me and fail. Bonk! What you gotta do, buddy? You gonna try to punch me and fail miserably? Well, I now climb upon your back. Bonk! I'm gonna get back up on there. I'm gonna get back up on there. A bonk! <laughs> oh, come on. Bonk! 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 Oh, okay. Ah! It bucked me off. It was an asshole. Please don't. Sir, thank you. Thank you for deciding not to do exactly what you were getting ready to do. I'm up on your back. Uh-oh. I'm no, I'm no longer on your back. I'm up on your back. I'm climbing up. I'm on top of it. Bonk! Bonk! I'm gonna climb up that big rocky ace. I'm gonna get up on top of it. I'm gonna get on it. I'm gonna get you. Boop! And then it explodes into loot! I should look at the picture. But this is gonna be uploaded, so I'm trying not to do that nonsense, you know? I'm trying not I'm trying not to have there being any inter interruptions. That word. Interruptions. That's the word. I'm uploading the I'm uploading the full thing. Like, I'm uploading these these streams and onto the YouTube so that way they're archived. So that way if I ever want to re-watch my adventures, or if anyone else wants to watch the adventures, that they can. You know what I mean? The adventures of Not Link. Need to figure out editing for that shit. I mean, if you were to be, if you were to edit these videos, I would probably pay you to do so. If I had money to pay you with, I would pay you to do so. I don't know how much, but I would at least attempt to pay you. Need to learn to do my own. I wanted those fruit. F. I just found a random thing, proceeded to murder it. Got lots of...
Beyond Macho. Open up, brother! Ancestral training ground. Us the Goron Blood Brothers are in the midst of a, conta of a contest of endurance. Be the burn, brother! They become strong and powerful Gorons. Right now we're competing to beat the heat! We're Gorons, but the heat is too much for us these days. Don't have to handle in Goron City. So you came here to train ourselves. I have an idea. Come join us. Oh no. This is gonna be a mistake. A test? Oh, it's a shrine thing. My God, man. <laughs> That's like negative damage I did. What do you mean I did negative damage? So you're going blood is good loose to you, brother. I'm granting you the highest honor, the chance to participate in the contest of ultimate endurance! is even harder than the last ring. Also with fire. It's said that passing the sister reveal a shrine or some such. I'd like to not do that right now. Also, I'm glad that I can see how long it takes for Mipha's power to come back. Because as soon as her power comes back, she can resurrect me if I if I happen to fall. Because Mifa is best girl. Prove me wrong. Because I would say being capable of resurrecting you if you if you fall qualifies as, you know, being counted as best girl. At least for right now. At least for right now. They see me hurt one of them, and then they immediately then they all immediately take off. Figures. I love how fucking pretty this game is. Oh, 
I'll take those five rupees, thank you. Some more hearty radishes. I should probably fine tune my sensor to those. I'm fine-tuning my sensor to those radishes because if I find them, also that's a big one. Good. If because for uh, whenever I can find some of those, I can use them to craft dishes that'll raise not only restore my health but also raise it would also give me temporary maximum health, which you know is like the most useful thing ever. Thank heavens I got this upgrade. Because this shit is really useful. I figure, hey, if I'm in an area that's rich in them, I may as well grab some while I'm here. Oh, I haven't zapped big hardy radishes yet, have I? F. That's my ability here. myself directly into a tree.
All right, go sleep, Russ. I shall be here in case you cannot. All right, you take care, Russ. I will see you tomorrow, and thank you for the lurk. Although, don't kill your computer. You need, you need that to make money, so don't kill it. It's a box buried in the ground here. Betting the shrines up here. Something's trying to crush me with rocks and failing miserably. That other, that other, that was just a random avalanche. Found it. Another orb means one step closer to yet more power. Synced swing. Okay, now how am I supposed to get this down? Do I hit it with a bomb, maybe? No. Hitting it with a bomb appears to have done nothing. That also appears to have done nothing.
just like that, I got it. Boomerang. Bang. Thank you, Boomerang Rang. I have no need for your doors, peasant. Now give me your essence.
Alright, now I'm gonna actually bother to go upgrade because I need more stamina and I would like more health. There must be like a full hour long recharge on that. If not if not longer than an hour. Uh, that's Zora's. There's Kakriko. statue you give me power therefore I am here to talk stamina vessel please yes please give me that power Container, please. I have a lead. I also didn't know I get I got to hear her let me know when uh, when the stuff is ready. 
That's very nice as a quick little, you know, hey, let me know that it's ready. Well, I shot the wrong kind of arrow at the rabbit. F. All right. Hello again. Goodbye, you horrifying thing. There's a big mountain east of this village, Mount Leniru. Please, on the west side lies that gate. I could finally hop three times, well, five times instead of just the four that I was able to hop before. Hop, hop, shoot it up. I'll be right back. Because I'm going to use the restroom. Seen no progress the last time I typed. I was eating two pizzas and you made no progress. And I went, did a shrine, did upgrades, then did a then did a side quest, then came back. And went to use the restroom too. I don't care! I don't care how, how much or little progress I make. You should know this. Boy, my, I have one additional heart container and my stamina wheel is a little larger. 
Pay attention. Don't mind me while I sail across the sky now. Going where I want. There's a flying thing. Don't know what that thing is. But it's up in the sky. And it's fucking huge. Where's my face? It's way down that mountain now. Don't mind this random dude while he tries to figure out how his uh, how his head ended up in the bottom of that canyon. He probably won't ever figure it out. Now he just waits for the sweet embrace of death when the sun comes up. I love the way they wobble. They jiggle when you hit them. And it's great. Hunting with bombs. There's a random rock. Just rush into game stone. You got this. No. I am in no rush. I will take my time. Thank you. I will explore this game at my leisure. Shrine. Where's the shrine? Up here. 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 I'm going to engage frog mode now. I'm gonna just kinda... I don't exist. I'm just a frog. Hopping around. 
Don't mind me. Just a figment of your imagination. Yep. Just a figment of your own rack of imagination. That's all I am. Let me guess, he's guarding the shrine, isn't he? I'm almost willing to bet that he is. Bye, buddy. I found what I wanted, and you're not it, so. I'm just gonna yeet myself over in this general direction. Aim for the moment. Oh, I get it. I understand. That thing's going to play catch with that, with that, uh, with that boulder. did it. Beautiful. Whee! Oh, I need to get, I, oh, I see. Now I need to shoot that. Easy. It's a lot harder to do when the, when the, your uh, your switch is in an inconvenient location and it doesn't let you just wiggle the Joy-Con around to be able to uh, to aim. I'll need to work on that. Doo -doo -doo -doo. Thanks for the free heal, my sir, and the orb. I am the appreciate. You want me to climb up that mountain, huh? Get to that little steep spot. Piece of cake.
<laughs> that moment when he's like, wait, what? Oh no. And I'm just like, boy, I'm about to learn you about pain. Ha <laughs> punk. Thank heavens for this random horse that just happened to appear. Yeah. Huh. Thank you, horse. I appreciate your patronage to my assistance. Oh, you can get even higher. Maybe. If you don't act like a cunt. There we go. There we go. Ascend! Ascend, my, my equine friend. I thank you for your patronage. You have assisted me greatly in this quest. Is a giant paper dragon. Hello, that could be very useful for me. Hello, boulders. Oh, shit. Well, one of those made a beeline directly towards my ass. I think I understand. You want me? There we go.
Treasure? Ooh. Definitely treasure. One more and I can upgrade again. Will this up pick my kid? I was expecting to Okay. The office is stable here. I wish I knew which direction precisely we were headed, but I don't, so we're gonna just kinda... Great Fairy. Tower just beyond the Tab Tabantha Great Bridge. Up at the top and look at the ground sometime in the afternoon. The sh tower's shadow will point to the Great Fairy's Fountain. See the tower I'm looking for. I have 
no idea what that is, but I immediately don't like it. That's enough. I'm gonna go investigate what that is. It would appear, as long as I don't let it see me, that I'm fine. So I'm gonna avoid letting it see me. Because I'm not all too keen on seeing what happens when it spots me. This game and it's fucking clips that you can never tell when you can actually stand on it. Well, I don't even have to guess what this is. Bye, little Korok. Thank you for the seed. Okay, so seriously, though, what the fuck are those flying abominations and why?
Find me while I just glide past literally all of you. I'm a man on a mission. I have places to be, things to do, etc., etc. Those things do not include you all, so... Oh, it's a blood moon. It's about to be. It's about to be a blood moon. Again, that's not my name. I am Stone. That's palm two. Here comes palm number three. You gonna react to it the same way? Yep. Here's palm number four. I just want his club, that's literally all there is to it.
there's all this ooze. Oh shit. Ow. Thank you, Mifa. Ow, my butt. I hate that you fucks can just jump on that stuff. Mifa remains best girl, despite being knocked off a mountain and then forced to roll down said mountain. Mifa's like, don't worry, I got you, and proceeds to restore me back up to full health with some bonus hearts on top of it to make sure I don't die. Because Mifa. There's all this ooze everywhere, and I don't think I can really, uh... Wait a second. What if I were to... No, wrong thing. What if I were to... Oh, I need something to burn. That, that, that poses a problem. I'm pretty sure this ooze hurts me. Oh, it does, yes, by quite a bit. So, uh, don't touch the ooze. Unless you want to get sent plummeting down, back down. Now, I believe that with the power of some stamina foods and some heart restoring stuff, that I can conquer this ooze. Uh, <laughs> I'm gonna climb this tower, damn it.
this tower is mine. You cannot stop me. I have conquered this. For I am stone. And to my people, there is no obstacle that cannot be overcome. Come on, face it. There we go. Put it in the hole. Slide her in. Give me some of that dream. Thank you. Gonna land on this rock to get my stamina back. Commence the gliding again. Don't mind me while I just glide my way to victory. Today, did you need something? Gish Gisane of the, of the Rito. Rito of Lake, to Lake Totori, where the, where the men are fine archers and the women better singers.
Yes, hello. It's not really a good time. Village, but well, you could say we're not in a welcoming mood. See the beast in the sky? That's Divine Beast Va Mado. Showed up a while back. The Reno warriors who flew up to check it out were shot down. It used to be a divine being that protected the village, but it doesn't seem very divine to me. Thankfully, the thing only shoots at anything flying high above the village. But still, it is pretty demoralizing for us Rito to have to fly so low to the ground. I gotta go find your, your elder person and go speak to them. I must begin the feely feels, you feel? Seen it? The Vine Beast saw Mado? Yes, I saw it. The village freaked out because of it, but I have bigger problems. My mom is so annoying. She asks me to help out at the store every single day. I don't want to just help. I want to open my own store and sell whatever I want. <laughs> Welcome to the Swallows Rouge, the finest in this side of Death Mountain. Perfect place to snooze your troubles away. A monster just appeared one day. Alright, the village non-stop. Can't take much more of this. I'm just running my mouth here. If you want to know the details, talk to the elder on the top floor. I mean, that's where I'm headed, so... Do you have arrows? You have some arrows. Ah. I'll take all of them. Welcome, Bird Lady. Stone needed things. You had things. Lined with molted Rito feathers, the stupid was made by Rito artisans for Hylians visiting cold climates. Feathers are stacked in each layer to retain body heat. <sighs> well, if I ever need to go into the cold. What's wrong? Whoa. Molly's dad got hurt, and Tulin's dad disappeared. Oh, and Big Sis and my little sis are all sad. And I can't do anything to help. Yeah, that'd be reason for concern, I would say. People disappearing and all that other nonsense. That would definitely be reason for concern. I'll deal with it later. Hello. Heal, why must you always insist on worrying your poor mother? Anger's daughter Kia wants to go to Warbler's Nest. She won't stop talking about it. They have five daughters, and ever since that beast appeared, they've been getting needier by the minute. It's like, at times like this, I wish he was around. Who are you kidding and think only of myself? But that's the thing about being a parent. You have to be bigger than your children. <laughs> Hello, Mr. Gigantic Owl! Oh, oh, don't 
object on your hip. Let it be... Forgive me. Where are my manners? I am Kennelly, elder of Rito... Oh, good! I found the person I was supposed to talk to! Is she can slate dangling from your hip. Yes, it is. Was he a champion like Master of Ali? What well, if you were able to board Divine Beast Vomito? Champion that's only been dead for a hundred years. This one must be a mere descendant, an inheritor of the Sheikah Slate. Champion descendant, if you would listen to this old man's request, you would have my charm of gratitude. The blood of a champion, there's something I must ask of you. I'd like you to do a Divine Beast Vomito, a giant beast circling above us. Only a chosen one, a champion, can stop a Divine Beast. You must enter the beast and bend it to your will. I'd explain this to more headstrong Rito warriors, but they wouldn't listen to reason. Teva and Hearth tried to confront Mado, but it did not go well, and Hearth was injured. Teva escaped unscathed, but I fear he now plans to face Mado alone. I'm Teva. If you work together, you may be able to stop the IV. Oh, I mean, my intrusion, but I overheard you speaking with the Elder. It sounds like you intend to help my husband Teba fight in, in the fight against Meadow. There's not much I can do for you right now beyond telling you are my husband. There's a place called the Flight Range. It's in Dronox Pass at the base of the Hebra Mountains. It's where Rito warriors prepare for aerial combat. And she's gone there to gather weapons for another run at Meadow. Take off from Rivali's landing, it's a straight shot down to the flight range. It's a memorial for the Rito champion, Rivali. Unnamed in the hope that, we'll, that none might forget the events of that horrible day. We're about to have a flashback! Are you ready, kids? I know very few can achieve a mastery of the sky yet I have made an art of creating an updraft that allows me to soar it's considered to be quite the masterpiece of aerial techniques even among the Rito with proper utilization of my superior skills I see no reason why we couldn't easily dispense with Ganon now then my ability to explore the firmament is certainly of note but let's not pardon me for being so blunt. Let's not forget the fact that I am the most skilled archer of all the Rito. Yet despite these truths, it seems that I've been tapped to merely assist you. All because you happen to have that little darkness healing sword on your back. I mean, it's just asinine. Unless you think you can prove me wrong. Maybe we should just settle this one on one. But where? Oh, I know. How about up there? <laughs> oh, you must pardon me. I forgot you have no way of making it up to that divine beast on your own. Good luck sealing the darkness. You fucking bastard! Understand, please do not hesitate to ask. Yes, I can see the shrine from here. Thank <laughs> you. 
Oh. He just straight up chopped my knees. Well, it's like 5 a.m., so I'm going to be picking this up later today once I get up. For now, this has been Stone. I'll be seeing you all in the next episode slash next stream, depending on which platform you're watching on. But I will be seeing you later.